Hey everybody, this is my latest blaster, uh, fresh off the workbench. As you can see, it's an Alpha Trooper, but with the front grip missing um, because it uses uh, a super core in there. It uh, has some other various features as well, um, as well as some of the bodywork, so I'll just run through them now for you. Um, the stock adapter, I never liked the way the worker one fitted on there, so I've designed my own, um, which just fits over. Um, I've got a custom designed magwell in there, which holds the mags, uh, the barrel, and the and supports the back of the supercore as well. It's got a dual position mag release as well, um, and the fitment of the mag means it will just slide out. Um, got the standard Picatinny rail on top. Uh, this is a Monkey Mods 35 mil centimeter barrel, I believe. Um, and then up front we have a, I don't know if you can see just inside there, uh, there's an orange ring which slightly gives it away. That's the worker scar. And in here I have a suppressor. Um, so the worker scar fits up to about there. In there I have um, uh, a barrel with, with holes in it with some foam around the outside and that just absorbs the, um, absorbs the shock of the sound. So this is the uh, insides of the Super Trooper. At the front we have a support uh, which fits into the shell. Down here is the mag adapter I made, kind of a dual position release there. So it'll just sit in there uh, with a or receiver support in there. Um, then the front section is mainly designed for this. It just keeps the darts down slightly. The darts were sitting higher than the line of the pusher and the receiver. And then just to the back, got the two supports for the super core in there. Just a right angle banjo fitting with a um, trigger valve down to support down there. And you pull the trigger. And that's it. So just going over some of the performance figures of this. I was getting, um, with the SCAR presser on, I was getting figures of about 210 to 220 FPS at uh, 60 PSI. So I'm fairly happy with those figures. I could probably turn it up a bit more. I could maybe get a slightly longer barrel as well. But for now, I think this is war ready.